It is fair to assume that if the saber-toothed tiger lived on and hadn't gone extinct, natural selection would have made it so that only saber-toothed tigers with smaller canines would have continued on. You don't necessarily need huge canines in order to kill prey, but if bigger canines were broken off easily, saber-toothed tigers wouldn't have been able to eat anything and would have died off. Saber-toothed tigers were competing with humans, and it was one of the reasons why they went extinct. Combine that with the changing climate at the end of the Ice Age, and it was extremely difficult for them to find food. Hey, if saber-toothed tigers hadn't gone extinct, that competition for food would still have been present. It's likely that they would have had to travel away from where humans had settled in order to find prey. They may have traveled farther north, following herds of large mammals to the Arctic or northern Canada. Either that, or they would have had to change their eating habits. Perhaps they would have resorted to eating humans instead of large mammals. Humans were still prevalent, large mammals were not.